All right, so I uh, I don't have an actual um, data plan, uh, actually a cell cell plan at all for an Android yet. Uh, I'm holding out for the uh, HTC Evo, but in the meantime, I want to have a phone that I can develop on, such as the Motorola Droid, as you see here. Um, but I need to be able to activate it without having uh, an actual an actual phone service plan. Uh, so to do that with the Motorola Droid. Um, as you can see I've just powered it up, I'm on the, the initial setup screen and all I need to do is touch the corners of the screen in a clockwise position starting at the top left so I'll touch top left, top right, bottom right, bottom left and as you can see I'm now deposited onto the uh, the desktop and from here it's just just the phone as it would be any you know if it was set up on a, if it was set up on a plan uh, of course, I can't make phone calls, send text messages, and do things like that. However, uh, the Wi-Fi, um, the GPS, all the other all the other functions of the phone are fully functional. Um, now, if I were to power this down, which I'll go ahead and do, uh, when it comes back up, it will. Since it's already, been, I've already skipped past that initial setup. Uh, it's going to skip past that again, but it'll take us to uh, an activation screen. And to get past that, all we'll need to do is uh, hit the back button or the home key. And I'm going to start the phone back up here. Okay, and so there's the uh, there's the activation screen that I was referring to, and I can just hit the home key, and that'll take us right back to the the normal desktop. Uh, of course, you can unlock it, and there's there's your desktop and icons and so on. Uh, so that's how you activate a, a Motorola Droid phone without actually having any sort of uh, phone service.